Almost, almost. <laughs> it's oh, Brody Sutter boy. cutting in and he scores. Speaking of great names in hockey, the Chelioses to the Sutters. Here's Dan Grady with a pass, ah. and that one just over the reach of Ferk. Held in by Sproul, left point, Lashoff. Long shot, score! Brian Lashoff, it might have been tipped in front by Andy Neely, and the Griffins are on the board to tie the game up at one apiece. Checkers work it into the Grand Rapids zone. Chelios to Boychuk in front, they score! Zach Boychuk launched the shot and parked on the doorstep was Derek Ryan to tip it in. Wahlberg with a puck from center and he'll score. David Wahlberg will put it away. 3-1 Charlotte with 40 seconds to go. Well, Obviously we, uh, we didn't match their intensity tonight. And that's why they came uh, with the win. And, uh, we should have skated more and plenty of shows, but now it's too late. We need to uh, get a good week of practice and uh, be strong on Friday. Uh, McCollum coming off kind of a rough start, seeing to perform well. How do you think he bounced back? I think he's playing good. Uh, he's practicing hard also. Uh, he really wants to win. Uh, it's just a little matter of time before he gets his wins. Uh, and uh, once he's going to get that first one, I think he's going to get on a roll. Uh, you coming into this season healthy, unlike last year, um, how much more of a positive outlook do you have for this season as opposed to the last season? A big difference. I'm looking for a fresh start. Uh, I need to work uh, harder than tonight, uh, obviously. But in general, I, I just need to work on little things and uh, keep skating and uh, just play my game. And as I said, it's a fresh start this year. I thought they played well. I thought uh, I thought our team played a good game. Um, just what it came down to, you know, we we had uh, power play opportunities. We didn't capitalize on them, and they capitalized on their last power play. And uh, you know, anytime you get caught with too many men on the ice, it always comes back to bite you. Mm -hmm. um, the guys came out after their first win on Wednesday tonight, seemed to look a little bit more confident. Do you think they look more confident tonight? Yes, uh, you know, like uh, I thought yesterday's practice was a lot lighter. I thought, like I said, I thought we played a good game. You know, we got to find a way to, you know, like we scored one tonight, but the thing is we're getting chances. Um, you know, we have to give our goaltenders goal support. That's the bottom line. Uh, Tom McCollum. Tough start on Saturday. Came out, looked a lot better. How do you think he uh, responded tonight? No, I think I think he bounced back. I thought he was uh, he was solid for us. Um, you know, every every game that Tommy's played, he hasn't had a lot of goal support. So, um, you know, it's just one of those things. That we'll figure it out. Um, <laughs> it's the start of the year, and the thing is, is that uh, you know when things aren't aren't going right, um, like like the too many men thing. Um, and the guys knew specifically who they had, but then um, a guy jumped, and, and, and those things happened. But I'll take responsibility for that. So it's you know obvious to say that getting a too many men on the ice penalty at the end of the game is really really annoying. You could say. Oh, it's very annoying because, uh, like I said, every guy knew specifically who they had, and so. But you know it's uh, those 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 things happen, and like once again the teams. The players in the team are getting used to what I do in the bench, and uh, you know you have to go through the learning process, and you know, and we'll get it figured out. It's, but I like the way we played tonight. Uh, the only things we didn't do is um, score a few more goals, and um, when you get a power play opportunity, especially a five-on-three. We got to capitalize.